Hello everyone, I'm Harrison and today we're going to be trying some Korean snacks. My good friend Gun from South Korea sent me a load. I don't know what's in here, but this is what we've got. I'm just going to start off by picking the first thing. This is what's up first. Oh, it smells like maple syrup. I don't even know what that is. Okay, very sweet. Is this f***ing cereal? It's kind of good. I don't know why it's reminding me of like a cereal of some sort. Oh, it says maple corn. I'm gonna give it a 7.2. They're pretty freaking smack. Your packaging as well seems so like thick. What the f is this? Oh, kind of milky, kind of creamy. I'm not really getting it. Also, I don't know how you could eat this many. Two, I feel sick. Honestly, I'm gonna give this a 4.5. Not a fan of this one. Right, didn't even look. I don't know what I'm about to eat. Very garlicky. Oh my god. Here now. Guys, you need to try these things. Still weirdly kind of sweet. My breath's gonna stink. Like that is, that's intense. I'm gonna give that a three. Three out of ten. Next one. Don't know again what this is. What the f is that? No, no, no. No, that's not okay. I like corn, right? It kind of tastes like vomit with sweet corn in it. Why do I want to taste more? Right, next up, we're gonna do these noodles. It's got an egg and an apple on it. So I, I don't know what we're in for. Must admit, I'm not a chopstick pro. I'm not a chopstick pro. How are you supposed to do this? Oh, I really can't tell what this is. I don't, I don't know is the answer. I honestly kind of like it. I'm gonna give it a 6.8. Next thing, prawn crisps. <sighs> honestly smell lovely. Oh, very prawny. Oh, very prawny. Okay, if I close my eyes, I do feel like I'm on the beach. They genuinely taste like the real thing. They don't smell too like fishy. You don't open them and you're like, whoa. 7.1. Okay, next one up, we have these noodles. It just says olive oil. That is it. Did a translation. They translate to chapagatti noodles. Don't know if that's right. We do have beef that had to be rehydrated. Whoa. This is a comfort dish. You want to eat good, but you haven't got a lot of time. Very meaty. Right, let's try a bit of the beef. Yeah. Is that real beef? It tastes like a little gummy worm. 8.2. Okay, next up. We have crispy seaweed chips. Can't say I've ever had these before. Yet again, the packaging is thick. It's solid. It stands on its own two feet. They look sus. I don't like seaweed either, so this is gonna be interesting. Wow, they're really good. The coating on them is spot on. That is bubbled up, it's nice, it's lovely. And it's actually stuck to it. That's an 8.1. I think that's my second favorite. I feel like we should go for something sweet. So these are called Almond Lot. Maybe this is like a Mikado, yeah, it's like a Mikado kind of thing. Yeah, again, packaging is thick. Even like the chocolate stick is thick. Like that's a thick stick. They're kind of bendy. They're not as crisp as I want them to be. I'm gonna give this a 7.8. Straight off the bat, this is a 7.8. It's no higher, it's no lower. Found out recently, I did a video eight years ago, I think, trying Korean snacks. Turns out none of the snacks were Korean. They were all Japanese. But these are officially Korean snacks. Next up, we're doing Samyang. Don't know what Samyang is. I feel like I'm pretty good with spicy food. I can't use f***ing chopsticks to save my life. Here we go. Here we go. Any, any minute now. <laughs> oh my god. They're pretty fire. Whoa! Good morning! Whoa! They're kicking. I can't breathe. It's actually burning my throat. My throat is burning. If it was toned down a bit, honestly, they'd be my kind of noodle. I'd give them maybe an, a, I'd actually go as far to say 8.8, .8, possibly nine. Jeez, these are mad. Oh, fucking hell. How do you eat that? I feel like I'm pretty good with spice as well. Okay, next up we have Calbi honey butter chip. what I mean. Your packaging is... All right, there we go. Damn, I got a kick there. God. No, no, they're kind of gross. They're stressing me out a bit. I need to try more though. 
We've got like some sort of parsley herb on it. They're really sickly. Oh, I feel like I'm just eating straight up butter right now. No, that ain't right. They're making me act up. You know what? I think I just have a fear. I was out at a restaurant once. This was like 10 years ago. So I was like 15, right? This has stuck with me. And there was this kid that was opposite me on this like other table. They were eating bread and butter, but the little packs of butter, this girl was just eating the fucking pack like that. From then on, imagine what it would be like just eating butter straight up. This is what I'm thinking this is right now. I can't do it. After I've done it a bit. I can't figure out what that is. Even the smell is making me gag a bit. Blech. No, I can't do it anymore. That's a, that's a straight up one. <sighs> that was rough. There is not one word that I understand on this. Oh, premium. They do have a bit of weight to them. What is this, like a mushroom? I feel like this is a mushroom one. I'm not really getting anything from this. Have Samyang just up my taste buds. This is probably the worst packet of noodles out of all of them. I feel bad. I'll be nice, three. Three out of 10. Okay, I think it's time for something sweet, seeing as my mouth is on fire. This looks like a Chips Ahoy. Choco chip cookies. Interesting shape for a cookie, honestly. Kinda like it. Wow. They're so light, crunchy, chocolatey. They remind me of like an American cookie I've had before. Tate's Bake Shop. If you know, you know. I'm kinda getting that. From these very similar next up we've got like an octopus and a fish so we've got a dolphin there <laughs> what is this they're kind of like crackers but crisps they're hollow salty and sweet it's very weird i don't know what that flavoring is i kind of like them 6.5 cookies 7.5 going in with the next one but like mini bread rolls not bad, kind of cheesy, herbs, like a breadstick herby thing. Not really my thing, to be honest. I'm gonna give this like a 5.5. Okay, next one. I'm feeling like this is a kind of Pringle. Yeah, it is. Okay, kind of like these discs and they've got like these ridges in. Wow, see, this is too artificial for me. No, no, no. Ugh, that one's like a, th that one's like a 3.5. Right, last one in this multi-pack. If you buy this as this, I'm so confused. All these flavors are so different. What's this one? I don't know why I'm acting like I can understand anything. Right, okay, kind of again, cracker vibe. I see like kind of sugar on top. Interesting. I know these are gonna be spicy. Eating all this sweet stuff has helped my tongue calm down a bit. So I think I'm ready for some more spice now. I just don't get how you open your packet. You have to do it like that. These are like sweet. Am I just tasting the cookies? All right, let me redo this. Okay, fresh test. They are kind of sweet. I'm not getting as much spice as I thought. These don't taste like anything I would have imagined. I've had paprika chips that are hotter than this. There's no spice. I don't really get any spice from that. Whether the Samyang have just ruined my taste buds, I don't know. I'm gonna see if them like a five out of 10. Nothing, nothing special there. Right, next up we have these. These are the premium dessert cake cacao lot. So I think lot is a big company over there. It's almost like it's been soaked in rum. I don't know if I'm just making this up. This is good. It's got like this cream filling. I'm gonna give it a seven out of 10. If you have any snacks that you wanna send me, find my address down below. You can send me some. I'm down to try more. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed and I'll catch you again soon. See you later, bye.